and we'll give you this back as well. Oh. Although it'd be nice to keep it, not breaking it. <laughs> <laughs> Still safe. There we are. <laughs> Take care. Now, so staying with the theme, uh, over to the weather with Thomas Schaffernacker. Good morning, Petal. <laughs> Excuse me. What did you say? Stay no, back to the studio. Simon needs to... What? 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 You just called me what? I called you Petal. <laughs> it's a form of endearment and no reason to have a big row on television about it. Actually, I don't think that's cool. I don't think that's cool at all. I was supposed to be a serious weather forecaster, not some flower. <laughs> a professional and brilliant, of course. Cloudy and warm, that's the, uh, the headline for today. Actually, I'll tell you what, today it's not particularly pretty out west, that's for sure. It's cloudy, it's drizzly, but at least the temperatures are fairly respectable. See, despite the fact that we've got the cloud, it's still around about 19 to 21 degrees. 21 is 70 Fahrenheit in London. We'll just keep on getting warmer, in fact, as we go over the next few days. Now, tonight, cloudy skies, there's a lot of moisture, warm Atlantic air coming our way. Look at these temperatures. Now, this is going to be one of the mildest nights we've had in a very, very long time. 13 degrees in London. In fact, most places, most urban areas into double figures. As far as tomorrow is concerned, I think there'll be a little bit more sunshine, at least across some eastern and central areas of the country. 24 degrees on the cards, but note a little bit of rain getting into maybe the north of Northern Ireland and also the western Isles of Scotland. And then by the weekend, it looks as though we could see, even by Friday and the weekend, we could see temperatures up to 25, maybe 26 degrees Celsius. Hope you have a flowery day.